<laughs> I, I was just going along. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure. Okay, we're live. Hello. We're live. Hello. Okay. Hello. Hello, everybody. Welcome. How's it going? Welcome out to Roundtable Does E3 2017. We did this once before in 2015. It was a lot of fun, and then a couple of these guys were physically there in Los Angeles last year, so sadly didn't get to do it then. But uh, yeah. we've, we've got our opportunity again this year, so welcome out, folks. Hooray. Right on time, too, it looks like. A lot so of I got incredibly mind-flooded by... Uh, <laughs> Like all of the conversations <laughs> happening on screen and in the Discord at the Absolutely, same time. Yeah. yeah. And on Skype and in chat. There's mm. too many things <laughs> happening at once. But it looks like they're literally starting now. So yeah, I think we're right on time. We 2013, 1920 by 1080 is mm -hmm. all. Chat, I'm going to be trying to work on the audio balance all the way throughout. Let me know how it is right now. Give me a vote yay or vote nay, depending on the yeah. quality. Well, it's Rob. Exactly. Yeah, Rob's here as well. Welcome Rob's out, here. Pack Patrol. Woo! Good to have you, buddy. Uh, how hangs it? How you guys doing? I'm just watching the Xbox E3 2017 briefing over at twitch.tv slash twitch presented by Roundtable Podcast, so I'm having a great time. Oh, that's great, yeah. Oh, I, uh, even better now that I muted the main uh, channel's chat. Good stuff. <laughs> even better. <laughs> Here we go. It's starting. They're going to show us the scorpion. Audio is good, but turn Mathis off. Oh, I forgot to turn Mathis off. Yeah, sorry. I <laughs> Damn it. You always that. forget that. Yeah. I know. <laughs> Damn it. That's just because we haven't hit that fifty thousand dollar tier on. <laughs> Yo, yeah. By the way, take. Me... I'm a computer science student. That's a microchip right there. Oh, nice, dude. <laughs> I'm so glad we have you for this. I was so confused this every time they had these videos yeah. before. Well, we oh, they put it on a motherboard expert, now too. So. Oh, those are capacitors. Fuck. I think I believe it's that's going information. Into the Scorpio. They're starting with the Scorpio. Yeah, they need to start with the Scorpio so everybody can swallow the five hundred dollar price tag first. <laughs> <laughs> I'm yeah. not bothered by that. That's not crazy. PlayStation I, okay, got from, away with it, and okay, it was stupid. Cool, up. But also, yeah, this but, is the most powerful hey, console. Listen, first of all, it's the most powerful console. Of That's all the time. one ring. Uh, the one ring. PlayStation did not get away with it. It fucking shot the PS3 in the foot from the outset. Yeah. It it, it made oh. them lose to Xbox 360 for that entire generation. Lack of games uh, did that. I well, that also. Focus, but Xbox and is that in that is same a car. situation. Xbox is now is already fighting up a massive uphill battle, and they have no library PS4. It's also so. a car. I don't know if you noticed that, but well, it, it, it did obviously the into problem a car. is they didn't have enough power in the prior console, and they're going to solve that problem, and then it's all going to take care of itself. It was also that the CEO of Sony was like, "Well, you know, people are just going to have to work harder for our console." <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah, that didn't really. He didn't make any friends with that one. Microsoft needs to, if like. Five hundred dollars is going to be for the most outside of us. For the casual gamer, is going to be an incredibly big asking price. So they need to come out swinging with games. Is that the form That's factor? Me. Looks like it. Yeah. I mean, yeah. are you surprised it's a box? Do you, can you no, see it, it, flops? I can I'm see surprised it. how similar it looks to the Xbox One. Actually. Oh yeah, definitely. Maybe how it's hard just... will it be for for Ryan to boot up Netflix on? Netflix? Yeah. I work in the games industry, and let me tell you, that's an Xbox right there. Oh hell yeah. <laughs> Looks fine. Hey, there Phil. He is Spencer himself. Leather jacket, graphic t shirt. Good luck, man. Because he's like a, a multi millionaire, but he's, he's also player. just like you. Yeah. He's a casual guy. He's player one, though. You player have to be player one. two at his house. That's such a like a dominant move. He gives you the Mad Cats controller. Watching on this it you, you're gonna play as guest stream. when you play at my house. Mm. <laughs> it's very petty, but it bothers me the controller is tilted to the left. Yeah? Yeah, but that's, how, that's how you know it's edgy. On behalf of everyone on Team Xbox. Chat can't hear it. Alright, yeah, it's not gonna get much louder, chat. Sorry, so... We'll try to stay quiet during the uh, actual talking bits. When the renegade group Dynamic of creators bear. and engineers came together the renegade group to form the, the renegade group Xbox came out. team and deliver yeah, click, the first click CC Xbox on the video console, frame. Oh shit. We were driven by three principles. Empower developers, Look at that. delight gamers, and deliver true hardware and technical innovation. We'll turn ourselves down a bit. The original Xbox team lived by the mantra, there's no power. Than no power no. than X. That, that, that was the mantra? All right, I'm tweeting that. Oh, is that how Here we go. I've, I've taken one. algebra, and that's correct. <laughs> <laughs> X gonna give it to you. All right, so we've, 
Fox One X. We balanced out of know what that is. Why couldn't they just stick with Scorpio? Yeah, Xbox sets a new X. quality standard for gamers and game creators. They should have installed an Xbox One Starting one. Starting on November 7th, Xbox One X joins the Xbox One. Xbox One X. Oh, that's such like a mouthful already. When yeah. It launches worldwide. <laughs> Xbox One X. Xbox One X, Xbox One S. XXX. We're in full now, Nintendo territory. I was going to say, we're territory right now. Nintendo territory. In the Xbox the Nintendo fucking territory. chat is a nightmare right now of just XX1, one, one Xbox, 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 one Xbox. Gamers and developers. <laughs> Hi, I'd like to buy uh, Kingdom Hearts 2.8 uh, Infinity Beam Dop Distance for uh, <laughs> Xbox One X. <laughs> oh, sorry, I thought you said uh, Xbox One S. We've got two different SKUs for that. <laughs> Oh, who's this guy? Thanks, Phil. What up, Dad? This is Dave, it's this an is honor David to be here at E3 and represent this three is years older David uh, Eric Bana. Has done the dream <laughs> Xbox One X. From the beginning, our focus on Just game creators natural. and you, the <laughs> gamer, keep your arms <laughs> acceptable. <laughs> 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 you. Keep arms straight. Move arm arms when talking. Longer than normal people's no. arms. Well, his, his, no, no. Look at his legs and his arms. They're both Six really long compared to his actual torso. I don't want to be judging the physical characteristics of the stage presenters, man. Come on. <laughs> I got into this memories. job to make computers. And Why did you make me talk? Second of memory bandwidth. Six teraflops GPU, 12 Holy gigabytes. Shit. Teraflops, chat! These are impressive numbers <laughs> that are more powerful than any other console on every dimension. Because on on every dimension? Now, game creators the power they need so you can experience true 4K resolution, 4K textures, and 4K assets in your living room. Wait, 4K. the assets are 4K? Or <laughs> does he mean the textures? Both. And when we Both say of them. 4K, <laughs> the textures are on the assets. Pixels, In every high dimension, dynamic range, it's 4K. Wide color gamut, <laughs> premium sound wide color like gamut. Dolby Atmos. Did you say gamma or gambit? They have never dropped the gamut. <laughs> Can you please just shove more words sound bite. than most people who buy this console don't give two shits about? Seriously. Compatibility. We knew compatibility was critically important for Xbox Com One. Compatible to play and video games. To 360 backward but not with Netflix. That's right. the team even more. So right I feel like from the Xbox start, One X is like Xbox so One close to being a palindrome that right. it makes me angry. Yeah. 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 Xbox One X is but like my screen name from when I was 13. Me, <laughs> that wasn't good enough. But if X it was Xbox to be a palindrome, One X Zephyroth 69 XX. You have today, You're right, they should call it Xbox One X Sob. Sob. Anisotropic filtering and faster load times. Ooh, I heard Woo, faster load yeah. times. I like that. I like that okay. phrase. I, even if you haven't made the jump to 4K I, I don't want to be rude, but you should not be whooping well. for it so plays Xbox all one Xbox One games. <laughs> Listen, backward compatibility has always been a soft spot for fucking Microsoft. Or yeah, it has. This is like sidewards compatibility, though. Like, First of yeah. all, it's already a step up from the Xbox One because it does 1080p naturally, not 900p upscaling. Yeah, but that's what they yeah. say. We'll, we'll see. Attention to every detail yeah, once they start turning the games out and they realize they can't quite make that frame target, they're just going to be like, yeah, we'll just drop it down a little bit. We'll, do, we'll put yeah. it to 1080 and it'll up. Scale to 4K, right? 360 square millimeter. Dude, you know what would totally Wait, sell me though is if they revealed that he was being powered by the Xbox. <laughs> would do it. This is the fastest. I, most you missed the biggest selling point. 360 7 square centimeter size uh, chip. Design means oh, that yeah. He straight up said the size of the chip. Every component within the console has been architected for maximum power and efficiency. Our aspirations like if she just so turned hard, around an and industry standard like pointed to a microchip on the back of his neck, I would be like, I'm ready. <laughs> 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 if you drop a subscription to Roundtable, I'll give you 4K commentary over this Xbox <laughs> One. This fucker has a vape chamber. Yeah. Oh wait, we knew that already, didn't we? Liquid cooled vapor chamber. An engineer oh, on the Xbox It's shaped like a fidget spinner. A new power management <laughs> system so innovative, we named it after him. The Wait, what? Method yeah, they're doing the Hobus! Yes! Every single Xbox One X. Chat, give me a Hobus. And component level. Oh, they to right there. Oh, there come the subscription. Here comes the 4K commentary. Nice. Hobus system. We're upscaling a resolution! But again, we wanted more. We want, we want more! Not only have we built the most powerful console ever. At Microsoft, Xbox we will never stop until we have it all. Xbox ever.
Whoa, the smallest the small. Xbox ever. Thus making it the fifth largest console to ever exist. This is the system <laughs> you asked us to build, and it has been a great honor to design and build Thanks, it man. for you. I couldn't you be more it for me. proud Thanks, of our Dad. team, and I hope you love it as much as we do. Now, <laughs> let's see what this monster can do. Let's <laughs> see what this monster Excuses. can do is what he says. Oh, fuck We're yeah, bud. Let's go. Oh yeah, I heard the X the Xbox One X twenty five hundred ZY is gonna run a Windows ten. Oh nice man. Wait, okay, it's Wait, sand. It, it's it sand. Runs planet oh, my. Earth. Ooh, that, oh my that god. Looks good. It's it's sci-fi sand. It's spec ops the line too. <laughs> it's no, gonna be camels, uh, man. They wouldn't have camels. Oh enough. shit. Nathan Drake betrays Oh no, Forza. No. Yeah, oh, it could be a big oh, Look at that. That's racing, man. That's the driver racing. is a woman. Oh, what? And did you think the back they, of the car? It's a Halo, okay. man. It's a Halo. F1. Okay. F1. ESPN presents Halo Indy Cars, featuring like Danica Patrick. I love how the the opening of this trailer could have been Forza, F1, Anthem, Battlefield. Like, could have been literally anything with the same. Mm -hmm. They love the desert. That guy's got the Switch yeah. Prime. Dude. Racing. Yeah, they're driving in cars. Look, I mean, Forza's always looking good. Yeah, Nobody is this Forza that. or is this F1? Yeah, it's Forza. It has to be. It's, it's F1. probably Forza. Even if a guy's driving his hair. He's driving his Ford Mustang in, in Ford Formula One. <laughs> it's Forza on the helmet. Yeah. Forza's usually pretty good. Yeah. It's, it's just funny it, it's that it's become their main cost. system seller now. <laughs> Cars. No. Seven. No. Seven. Damn. No. What's funny is that it's actually like he's welcome the 14th from the Forza, Forza. Racing franchise. <laughs> and this is where Michael they come Ball. out and they after after this they be like, we only canceled Scalebound so we could bring it to the Xbox One X. <laughs> oh shit. Just kidding. You're not getting that. In the automotive anymore. world, supercars are debuted at international auto shows. Oh, I saw a bingo card for this. Detroit. And one of the things was, do <laughs> they have a car on stage? On Here it comes. Oh, man. Oh, dude. Moment of truth. We had it last year. We had it last year. That thing on the left side. The automotive where it says yeah. Motorsport 7 <laughs> and there's like a glass case. The Where's the, the car, car coming from? It's going to come up from risers. I'm thinking right side. Stage right. Here. Chat, place your bets. Will there be a car? It's actually 100%. He just said it. Yep, there you oh, go. Oh, no. you, you can't bet anymore. You can't bet anymore. Year, Bets are closed. Six year partnership with Porsche. God to damn it. Bring you Porsche? Amazing experiences, both in game Need and noise. in person. Porsche shares our vision for the future of Porsche? Microsoft and Esports. We're here for the and gamers. Car the everyman. That's why we're unveiling a brand new $330,000 <laughs> supercar. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, may you I can buy this car the here at E3. <laughs> Porsche 911 you can GT2 buy this in stores RS. right now. <laughs> <laughs> and just oh, for you in the audience, we're giving everyone a Porsche. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, who had the bingo spot, which is 90% of the presentation the most completely unrelated to the gaming industry? <laughs> design. It features the most powerful road going 911 paid? engine. Ever made yeah, do they happen. pay for like this? The Xbox One X, <laughs> Probably. It's a monster. Wait, what are they? With over 4.8. They do this like every year. Players. That's a sick Xbox car. And yeah, this, this is, is a sick car, but like, the, is one of the we're just talking about the car. Yeah. yeah. Car commercial. Listen, if you pre-order <laughs> Forza <laughs> Seven, you can have that car in. Possible. <laughs> the car is powered the racing, by the Hovis method. The digital and the right. real world are merging. And it's got 4K texture. So now let's take a look at the Porsche 911 GT2 RS in Forza Motorsports 7 running on Xbox Here's One a car X. you can't afford in a video game console that does not exist yet. <laughs> e -sports I'm Shannon McIntosh. Hi, Shannon. Shannon. Driver, Shannon McIntosh. Are you going to pretend Porsche you're playing the game now? <laughs> Why, Matt? Is because she's a woman? No, because she's on stage. Because she's an E3. Yeah, wow. she's at E3. I will be fighting to survive dynamic Oh, she's a professional driver, shit. In this Nissan fighting driving. to survive, though? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like, right, they're gonna kill her. Dubai. 
You're the, already missing an opportunity. This is your opportunity Xbox to bring back Connect. One of them is racing with the controller, the other one is racing with the Connect motion. With the, the hands out in front of you? Yeah, the hands out, and she wins. Because it's just that good. But she is like, they're allowed to show the car crashing in this uh, E3 demo? Mm, uh, this is This is actually Forza Motorsport 7.mp4 that they recorded like three weeks ago. So, Forza, uh, they allow a little bit of crumple damage, right? It's only Gran Turismo that doesn't at all. Happened. We just switched we to a totally different place. Yeah. Now it's raining. Right. Right. There's a dynamic day-night cycle. That happens <laughs> instantaneously. Yeah. Yeah. Did you guys, have you guys ever seen like a wall of rain actually coming toward you? Yes. That yeah, shit is yeah. awesome. We've made but we're back in the desert. Grand. Race through and living arms. environments, featuring spectacular it vistas. Looks really good. pretty. It does look really good. Yeah. I want to see I have the nothing crowd. to complain about, about this if I was into it. And surprising. Yeah. Puddles grow as the storm unleashes. Yeah, she's clearly playing, Dynamic Chad. Puddles. I don't know. I don't know if there's Dynamic any confusion there. Grow. It's more thrilling and competitive. <laughs> I wish they would do like a rally cross kind of game, though. Whoa, the cars crash, kinda. And it's more beautiful and alive. I don't understand. Is she like? Are we supposed to believe that she's playing back and forth? The are these the two well, different people well, playing? They're, they're, it's taking finish. Okay, and then I didn't know if that was what was going. On. But they're not racing together because they want to show off twice as many weather effects simultaneously. Right. Yeah, sunny and rain. Racing they got sun and rain. Is reborn in Forza, whether running on the Xbox oh, One, family done. of consoles, they do rally. I know, I have their rally. I love it. Forza Motorsport Seven is the most technically advanced and comprehensive racing games. Ever made. Forza came out on PC With last year, right? Yeah, cars, Windows 10. It features the largest yeah. collection. This is going to be about we say that doesn't count. <laughs> yeah. Basically assembled. doesn't. Today, you are the first people to see the 2018 Porsche 911 GT2 RS. Oh, dude. And this week at I can't E3, wait. Like me, I feel privileged. You can be the first to drive it. You can be the first to drive it? Please tell so me you pre-order it's a pre-order bonus. The most powerful road-going 911 Are they just letting random made. people from the crowd the just Xbox drive this thing X, around the parking the lot? That's what you think. Doing donuts. Yeah, that's, that's exactly what it was like last year. Seven. Thank you. Everybody's harping on Porsche and Forza. I'm pretty sure those are the correct pronunciations. They are. We're here to announce uh, Microsoft Flight Simulator 11. Boeing's <laughs> unveiling their new 797. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Twin powered Rolls Royce engines. I'm gonna play a ton of Forza Motorsport 7 when it ships on October 3rd. No, you will. And when Xbox One X launches, we will God, all get to experience name. Forza Motorsport 7 in true 4K you not learn from the Wii U? at 60 frames per second. Wait, did he just say when the Xbox at One X is coming out? Today, October 23rd is when the game's coming out. The so it'll be the creators. Yeah. With a lineup of he said true 4K at 60 FPS. That's a great time. I'm starting to get a slight inkling feeling that this console is going to be, a, be available in like a month. Games that we've ever it's tomorrow. On Xbox E3 stage. Maybe. Games from creators large and small. Games um, that inspire and really challenge I guess us. November games usually. You know, like yeah. hand gestures? He's doing like a Tyrion Lannister thing with his hands. It's freaking me out. And games that He's rolling a bunker every once in a while. I don't know if you noticed Today, that. That's a Tyrion Lannister move, dude. Oh, did they already say November? <laughs> Apparently they already said November. 42 ah. games on stage. Ah. Including... There you go. 22 games with console exclusivity. It's like it's stupid for them not to say November because that's when you sell it. Yeah. 20, so, 22 exclusive these games. That's not bad. Why are these people from the, the Microsoft team, family? Basically. Yes. But of course, <laughs> yeah, like, my experience at the Sony conference was Xbox they'd be like, X. and you can play this game that looks great only on PlayStation, and Up people next, were like openly weeping, and then <laughs> you, you look at their name tag, and it's like I'm head of publisher relations. <laughs> worked with us to yeah, like who cheers a single for player masterpiece that I played on Xbox 360. Now I'm honored to bring them back with the premiere of their next work, running in engine in true 4K. What are we, what? They keep saying world true premiere. 4K. I, I bet true As has there's... a star after it, and it means yeah. it's not 4K. <laughs> <laughs> world premiere. The Division 2. This is the world premiere. <laughs> uh, no, that blood says it's a Gears of War game. Uh, oh no, it's Division 2. Is it? No, I have no idea, but I, I just Polish saw a shit APC. Oh. Uh, Stalker? Oh. Ooh, are we looking at. Ooh, if it's the oh, new Stalker. New Stalker. Metro. New Metro. 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 Uh, okay. okay. That's cool. 2 4K? Yeah. 
That's why Metro went on sale today. That makes sense. Nice. Oh. Oh, you crafty. Wait, this is the, um, it's the 28 Days Later song, right? Uh, no, uh, it sounds ever. like it, but I don't think it is. Yo, if you've never played Metro, chat, it's on sale today. It's great. It's good. Great what if Metro don't trust you, though? <laughs> then he's going to shoot you. That looks really nice. Yeah. Yo, this is the 28 Days Later theme. Oh, yeah, you know what? You're right, it is. One million percent. Yeah. New Metroid. The lighting effects are really good. Oh, I was hoping it would light that spider web on fire. Yeah. Nice, yeah. Now, Metro's been a gorgeous series. I yeah. love Metro. Rodents of unusual size. <laughs> hey, no, I don't it onto the fire. Okay, so this is an in-engine pre-rendered Yeah, you're right, it is. <laughs> totally not in the game. Yeah. Damn it! I was buying that the animations were that fluid, but yeah. once you said it, it's like, nope, that's yeah. not right. Yeah. Guns don't move that way in games. I mean, either way, if this is an engine, it's still pretty impressive. Did they say if this was a console exclusive? Because I hope we see it on I yeah, love it. Well, you can get it on Windows 10. Right. Then, yeah, it works for well. Dad, then he crush his head in the door. Yep. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Classic. Punch him. Nice. Oh, oh wow. my nice. goodness. Jeez. Stab him in the eye. Very rude. You didn't have to blind but him. You really just let him go. Jesus. Him. Oh, interesting. He can go outside without the mask on. I thought you could do that for a bit in. Yeah, but it's like it's all life. green. It looks like the plants Depends are. Depends where you are. There were like Ooh. radiation oh, zones all right. open. zones. Oh shit, is this gonna be stalker style where it's open? So is the metros like haven't been. Fallout 4, but actual Fallout 4? Or like that Just call like it shirt. Fallout 4 yeah. again? That would be hilarious. <laughs> That's Good Springs as far as like my Good Springs canonically goes. <laughs> yeah. Oh no, Rumble Muffin, I'm not saying this doesn't look like what the game looks like, just the animations. I don't mm, they look yeah. too dynamic. Oh hell yeah, sorry, this I'm looks so like proper game. though. If this is an open world thing, it seems like they're implying that for sure. Yeah, that's what it seems like. Just because I, I loved the Stalker series, and this Metro was the closest thing to Stalker you could get. Great mod for yeah. players on known battlegrounds. <laughs> <laughs> this looks pretty impressive. Yeah, I'm down. I'm so yeah. down for this. Yeah, that thing had to go. Oh, that dog no. was just hanging out. <laughs> He was eating he was, that, he was that, that was a body. dog anymore, Rob. Oh, he didn't Can even be mad him. at a nuclear dog for eating a dead person's face. Like, that's <laughs> just mother nature. Exactly. He didn't even... Like, musical crescendo, something's gonna happen! Yeah. Yeah. Oh, uh, behind him. Oh, oh it's a rancor. It's bear! <laughs> it's like a bear mole. So why was he wearing his, his like, mask underground, but not above there? <laughs> That's where the nuclear dust gets deposited. Oh, gotcha. You gotta knock him off the cliff. Yeah, do it, do it. Is that, is that crossbow a shotgun as well? No, he had an explosive round. Yeah, he put, like, an explosive arrow. Alright, this doesn't seem... Nasty. I think we're going in and out of in-game render versus yeah. gameplay. Yeah. yeah. That's what it seems like. Just to be as confusing and obfuscating as possible. <laughs> that was dangerous. Yeah, yeah. it really was. <laughs> that right. was a love interest. Well, I gotta say, if that was their escape plan, it was way too convoluted. He could have just walked <laughs> the train. <laughs> That's why we have stations. <laughs> stations. <laughs> I'm Metro. Those. Here's Metro. the thing. We're like too old for E3. Yeah. Because ah. for us, it really could have just been like, hey, there's going to be a new Metro. And we'd be like, oh, okay, that's cool. <laughs> then we watch the trailer and we get all uh, snarky 2018, about it. Yeah. That's got a I mean, the point to is to be cynical. Yeah. World premiere. Is that cool? the point? This is a world yes. premiere. <laughs> Actual, well, Maybe. I mean, they said that about the last one, so. It doesn't say they captured it in true oh. 4K, though. It just oh, it's okay. Assassin's Creed. Wait, really? 100%. Yeah, is, yeah. No, really? The first. Well, they said that looks like ass a second ago. <laughs> One million percent assassins. Oh, yeah, there's a bird, you're right. Yeah. Yeah. Their beasts. The first to guard the soul from evil. 
We have an occupational obligation to not let people get excited about a new Assassin's Creed. <laughs> yeah. This is the one where they have to come out with it and knock it out of the park. And then you get excited about Assassin's Creed 12. Right, yeah. Is really that typical when he gets that hammer down? I wanted to make the carnival sound and go ping. Yo, I saw they boats though. On the wind. Yeah. I yeah, like it's got that. the Illuminati sign in there. A brotherhood yeah. born in the shadows. We don't even know where this writing is going anymore. I think this is like the origin of, of Assassin's Creed. Can you just play as Jesus Christ in one of them? Yes! Oh my god, Jesus the Assassin! Just slaying everywhere. Oh, this is it's for honor, actually. Chasing the, <laughs> chasing the money changers out of the temple. Fuck yeah, dude. This looks, okay. This yeah? Looks like, this looks like it Assassin's looks fucking Creed. incredible! <laughs> <laughs> it just looks like Assassin's Creed. Like, I don't understand the, oh, the hype monitor. is here. He's got the Captain America shield, too. Yeah, that's pretty dope. Oh, everything. that was such an Assassin's Creed crouch in the air, dude. <laughs> Assassin's Creed is it Assassin's Spike. Creed Brotherhood? What? Please call it this Assassin's Creed Brotherhood. Mythical snake. Origins. Ah, oh, you nailed it. What, why is there a basilisk? Please welcome. Why are people excited? Creative director Sean. <laughs> when you why did they pick another one-word title? It's time to go backward. <laughs> We don't want to go forward. <laughs> Please welcome the creative director, Sean Binden. Actual name, Jean Guiz. <laughs> <laughs> it is also the birthplace of the Assassin's Brotherhood. Good old closed Assassin's captions. Assassin's Creed Origins. Sean Binden. Point. Hasn't there already been one called Origins? I think, I think it was called Chronicles. years of history oh. and mystery at the tip of your fingers. If it's, it's not DJ Weed Cat. That does look like him, though. Story of one it's Sean Binden. No, this is Dishwa Huet. Bayek is the last Mechai. Oh, that's it. I get it. The protector of his there we go. Community. Yeah, oh. good one. Deep joke right sheriff, there. If you like. I reached in for that. And he struggled against well, the Well, now you guys know what you're getting with your next NGD NVIDIA GeForce card. The so, get ready. Mm -hmm. of the Assassin's Brotherhood. But recreating ancient Egypt, going back so far in time. Okay, that's... Hey, now. All right, hold up. <laughs> First of all, we're going to be... This guy is telling me it's going to be an open world. Yeah. We're going to have some RPG elements. More detail it's going to be an assassin. We're going to be an assassin. Yeah. So today, Rob, I want to hear you speak French before you start making fun of this dude's English. Like uh, Xbox one, one, Xbox one X. <laughs> We're going to be unveiling a new ancient Egypt and now, live on stage. Just for you, <laughs> Bayek is coming back to Siwa, his hometown, to kill the fake oracle Medunamun. Hook me up with a, an Assassin's Creed 300. Premier. You play as Leonidas. World yeah. Premier. Beat ass all day and oh, all night. Oh shit! We're gonna see it in action, guys. Here we go. I hate that they, new logo. The riot, so right, bad. right. Like they, they need. It's been two years since we have an Assassin's Creed. They need to like knock this out of the park. Yeah. If this is like a Wait. genuine nine, then I'll give people the right to be excited about yes. new Assassin's Creed without it being. Could be. But like, yeah. it's there's so much they need to change about the formula. I just hate the cycle. There's a tower. There's a tower. I think there's, there's only time. like. I think there's only one Assassin's Creed I'd give a 9 out of 10. Yeah, but five years the first ago, one. there would have been like four that you'd give a 9. Assassin's Creed 2 and Black Flag are the two that stand out for me. Assassin's Creed 2 is uh, brilliant. See I love that game. Only oh, the third go. one is good. When you're, when you're cynical at E3, everyone goes like, oh, you're jaded. Can't we believe in anything good in this world? And then when it comes out and it's like an 8, I'm like, oh, it's pretty good. And then people go, no, you idiot. They hate everyone. And it's <laughs> profit driven garbage. So you can so, already see at the top all the icons on the map. Yeah. Please tell me he's gonna climb a tower in this demo. I will. Please. I mean, this is the one Ubisoft game I'll give that ability because it's it invented the tower. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, it was the so, first. Every, Ubisoft has Assassin's Creed like its entire library Life, mostly. Yeah. yeah. So, I'll give I'll give Assassin's Creed a benefit. I just Did don't they know even what, have hay back uh, then. Whoa! Right. You get to be a bird. You're a warg. This temple resembles a fortress. Like, what do you jump what off of happened? into from the towers? Mummies? <laughs> yeah, that'll work. Yes. Sarcophagi. Oh, you just land and it wraps you up yep, and you're like, oh, I'm a tough man. Skip right. some steps, go right to your tomb, man. There you At this are. point, my question is to you guys, At what do, what do they have to the do with the Assassin's Creed on my list. to, like, change Rogue up Legacy death system. Oh, 
<laughs> Every time you die, you come back stronger than last time. Tip the balance but seriously, like, what do they have to do with the formula to change it? Because, like, like, I don't know what they would have to do uh, at this point to be like, oh, if, man. If it's a true so RPG, I would be pretty into that, actually. I don't think... I mean, the, I don't choice think they're they're kind of system, kind of system or...? Huh? Which, which, which you're gonna have to be more or? specific. Yeah, <laughs> like, uh, well, you know, like, more of a... Oh, uh, shit! Cool. That's pretty That's... cool. Now it's time to tip the balance of R on Ajbiz. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I want them to change it, nor do I think they're going to in any meaningful way. Be careful here. So then it will just be enough. another Assassin's Creed. Would... But, like, yeah. they... I don't know. It, it's pretty ridiculous of me to say because it's the joke is haha Assassin's Creed same every year, but like I'm not gonna play it broken, still, but it uh, looks like the people that are enjoying the series are still going to play this one. Dynamic weapon degradation. That's what it needs. Oh god, please no. He's got the bow of Amenotes. Oh they have loot? Okay. Yeah, like you said, it's got RPG elements, so they're it's gonna It's got destiny loot now. I think that's- I think they're trying to do Shadow of Mordor, actually. I was just referring to the minimalist squares in the inventory, that's all. Don't shoot him in the fucking arm, what are you doing? <laughs> that Roman soldier was not very rich, Yeah, he was fat, say. dude. Yeah. Out of shape. <laughs> that's what happens when you're the, like, leading empire. You get lazy. Yeah, exactly. Silk slippers. But Can the know. bird do a drop attack and just rip his throat out? That'd be crazy. bombs ass. A hundred percent there's gonna be like a way to spec into bird build. <laughs> bird, bird build. Yeah. Can... Can... Eagles just hover? No. No, I was yeah, just wondering that, actually. I was like, that's not a <laughs> thing no. a bird can do, is it? Listen, he wasn't hovering, it went into slow-mo. Oh he man, that ten-foot drop. Me. Jesus. <laughs> He'll be real disappointed. Oh by god, that. my Turn knee is sore. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, that guy falls that far and he's fine, but the guy he knocked off is you dead? He wasn't trained. Oh. He wasn't trained to be an assassin. What the oh, fuck? What a life. Okay. Boss fight. All right. I don't like the uh, damage being, you know. You're right. They shadow a Mordor this. Yeah. It looks like they changed like, up uh, the combat finally. Yeah, it's like, it's like Dark Souls in combat? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that animation though. It, it says Alpha. I mean, I'll yeah, okay. It. Yeah, yeah. Finally. Oh, <laughs> oh my <laughs> god. Yeah. Oh, oh, we what? Got, what? <laughs> Magic what? arrow! Magic arrow! <laughs> oh man, that looks so janky, dude. <laughs> dude, <it was laughs> an arrow. <laughs> Those two leopards about to make out there for a second. I don't know if you guys noticed that. I'm about God zero me, percent you will convinced, die. actually. Yeah. yeah, I am as well. I, I, <laughs> not gonna. That looked like Assassin's Creed with a loop. At Xbox, we've always believed in the power of games to unite us all. Uh -huh, Today, sure communities of gamers not only play together. Take they a drink every time he goes. Tyrion and Lannister hand. Together. <laughs> a whole new genre of games. Has he says he wants us to play together, but has he ever used fucking you play? <laughs> And with Mixer, we're innovating new features to make these There's the uh, Mixer. Uh, oh, live streaming? That's, yep, that's the Mixer the Bingo Square. So All the games <laughs> in this genre. Here is one that the world is I'm real curious. Pardon me this as they are moment. Uh, and oh, here comes the answer to PUBG going on Xbox. Team Xbox. I'm really curious what the Twitch chat is saying in response to this Mixer advertisement. Yep. So hold on, oh, let me yeah. just... Well, developer. rip Twitch, rip Twitch. Rip Twitch, Mixer, lol. Yeah, yeah, community. that's about what I expected. Okay, <laughs> well, there it is. Player unknown himself, <laughs> Brendan Green. Oh, yeah. shit, it's player, player, player unknown! Player unknown. But now he's, he's gonna be known as known. Now he's known. I now heard just... he only eats chicken. Well, no wonder they didn't call it Brendan Green's afternoon, Battlegrounds. <laughs> that sounds like a like Victorian England political <laughs> simulator. <laughs> <laughs> Our Battleground is the House of Lords prior to the Boer War. Ever to <laughs> ...and deliver a great experience across all Xbox One devices. Our development Player is known. truly community-driven, and we owe much of our success to everyone who's given us feedback. That says it looks like me. Does it look like me? Uh, yeah, with over a, a little bit. Uh, kind of. 
we can't wait to bring Player Unknown's Battlegrounds. Man, I really hope it's cross platform so we can get a lot easier. Yeah. <laughs> Just One plug X in your Xbox One keyboard and mouse if version. you wanted to, <laughs> even if it's not cross platform. <laughs> everyone. Exclusive. Please have a yeah. Please have it be cross platform. So yeah. Control it's not exclusive. <laughs> we I, got a I live blue hole. I played it on my <laughs> PC. Live blue hole, boys. It's C dot. That's C dot. It's C dot. <laughs> yeah. They just said it's exclusive. And I have it now. The, the fights don't go on. Ryan, like you just sounded like a child identifying their favorite superhero in a comic that's book movie. Like that dude. That's Batman. I know I've him. I've never seen a C dot that spicy. <laughs> They should just do concerts where you go and stand in a big pit full of people and they just show you places in this game. <laughs> that no, is not how that world fight world will go down. What the no, fuck is that? That's, not. I that's love exactly that how this goes. Nobody's <laughs> shooting a little hole in the door and throwing a grenade through it. <laughs> <laughs> they said they could play it in Ultra K, 4H, 4K, HD. What? But oh, you want to try that one again for me? <laughs> Ultra K, 4K, <laughs> um, X Bone, X, X. That's Wheatfield, everybody. Wheatfield. Hey, yeah, that's Hill. Kind of cut, like an action yeah. game trailer here. None of my games have ever looked like this. <laughs> <laughs> is that the lobby? <laughs> Did they just show the lobby? No, there's a plane crash in the, in the This map. is like when they show those incredible cinematic trailers for EVE Online, which is a game that you spend mostly, like, still. Yeah. Yeah. Bridge troll. It's like, they had, like a lot of motorcycle on the yeah. bridge. <laughs> there's not even that many bikes in the game. To be battlegrounds, everyone. <laughs> yeah, this game. Is <laughs> how about you just pull? How about you pull the trigger as the guy is like running? <laughs> yeah, there's a free <laughs> kill right there. He didn't see him. He was oh, so spicy. Oh. Nice. I've gotten one pan kill in my entire life. <laughs> that was fun. Exclusive. Damn. All right. Well, they did just say Player Unknown's exclusive. Battlegrounds was exclusive as well, so. Coffee stain, ghost, what is this? Oh, God, here comes the expansion of No Man's Sky. Don't say it. Don't say it. <laughs> don't think, don't say it. Coffee stain don't is say. like. Is it coffee stain like the ghost in Is it? Is it? Maybe? Yeah, coffee stain is the ghost in guys. Here it is. It's a No Man's Sky too. They make uh, Astroneer? Yeah, it this looks, looks an awful lot like Astroneer, like doesn't actually. it? This is Astroneer. This is kind of bordering on, uh... uh it look, listen, as a survival looks, guy, it looks interesting. Yeah. Exactly like Astroneer. Okay, that's different. <laughs> well, okay, there weren't the... Okay, now they got... All right, this is... There we go. I think they're a little flavor for it. Dwarves in space. <laughs> Let's see. Called Space Dwarves. Deep Rock. Oh, Galactic. Danger, Danger Darkness Dwarves! <laughs> yeah. Yep. Yeah. yeah, they're Space Dwarves. Uh, That's great, actually. actually. We are PC, all going though? B to die. <laughs> <laughs> I love the close caps. That's like a Call of Duty reference. Oh, <laughs> uh, this could be the sequel to that zombie survival from like four years ago. Uh, it's actually a Freaker survival game. The the one with the... Ma the... They have hogs, right? They ride oh, their hogs. Man. That's a Sony exclusive. Oh. Yeah. Sony's World. Called? State of Decay 2. State of Decay 2. Yes, yes. Damn. State of oh, Decay was comfort. great. State of Decay. Yeah. State of Decay. State of you Decay. You got to uh, build like a base and kind of manage resources and stuff. That's yourself. What no would you do love. if the world you knew was gone again? <laughs> again. Oh hell, I'm I'm down for State of Decay. Bring it on. I, I actually am too. Like State of Decay, the first one had some really cool ideas. He kissed that man on the mouth. <laughs> the army's pulling out. Come on. So how are the zombies different in this one? They're different because they can use weapons. <laughs> Sometimes they are organized. We all have one out of us. Well, what's cool about State of Decay is like if you die, you're permanently dead, and you take over somebody else in your set. I would yeah. love to see the management aspects of the game uh, fleshed out. That's what I want as well. I'm waiting for Zombie U2, where you play as Edge and Bono, and you fight zombies. <laughs> zombie, zombie, zombie. Where the streets have no brains. <laughs> <laughs> 
Oh, this is more battlegrounds right here. Michonne! Yeah. Firing into melee like that is very dangerous. Yeah. Yeah, they just like firing squad that lady. I owe you. What she is owes that face? I know. <laughs> that is such a good face. <laughs> How will you choose a that was a weird to little one and a half second clip to include of like mm -hmm. the truck pulling out with her in the back. Yeah, see, this is the stuff I want to see more depth in. Yeah. You can make a falafel truck. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Work together to and you can play as Dennis from It's Always hey. Sunny. <laughs> from the terror. Just outside the walls. I hope they have randomly generated survivors this time, though. Yeah, that'd be great. Oh, see, I knew armless zombie. And you yeah, armless hungry. screamy zombie. That's Absolutely. Michonne. <laughs> what risks will you take? She became what everything she hates. Will you make? Oh. oh, it's a boomer. Oh. Overweight zombie. Oh, there's always an overweight zombie. And more one with apart. butcher knives. Will now, yeah, now there's got to be one with like a really long. Oh knives. no, they're gonna shoot or her because she got bit. Ooh, we're safe. Please, shoot. this is our only one. But Maybe this time she won't up. die. I think she already turned. <laughs> oh, she said, "Thank you for saving." Shark him, yeah. Oh, they opened the door. <laughs> Overweight long arm zombie! <laughs> it's an actual boomer that's an actual <laughs> boomer. Well let me get this bile on you. They should really avoid hitting them with the car. It's only gonna cause trouble. Wait, are they playing gun sound animations but showing no muzzle flare? No, it's like like no, no ammo. No ammo. Oh. Like, oh. This is large, overweight, small armed. Oh. Wow! Oh, Wow, he's oh. pretty gross. Yeah, she's dead. Oh. How will you find the strength to carry on? Well, at least like you won't be a zombie. Take over as her. Eight different kinds of overweight zombies. I can't imagine wanting to engage something that just ripped my friend in half. Yeah. It's Shadow of the Colossus too. <laughs> Final oh, oil coming out of his head. That's a long trailer. I think this game is very fat of honestly. Of living and the dead. Yeah. Show me a fat survivor and then I'll, I'll get back on board. How will yeah. you survive? Show me a fat survivor stabbing the shit out of a skinny zombie. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> That'll teach him. We just end them with these poignant quotes like you want to make a t shirt or something out of this <laughs> nonsense. Mm -hmm. That eagle's oh. holding an axe and a shotgun. You'd play a game and called Fat Also a Lucid. Skull. Fat Zombies <laughs> is a good name for this game as well. That's a that's a good alt title. Ooh. Scavenger Studio. More zombies. You what will you two. do when the world you knew is gone? <laughs> <laughs> it's really unfortunate they lined those two up that way. Yeah. Zombies in the winter. <laughs> Long dark straight two. to the point, isn't he? Whoa, there's a sky laser. Yeah. Oh my, you know what this is gonna be? This is gonna Star be Wars. a fucking online multiplayer, like build a base, survive against other players. Bullshit yep. game. You're right. Two It'd be great if this is just Clash of Clans. Oh wait, it's a battle royale. Ah, it's a battle royale. Yeah. yeah. I'm okay with that. <laughs> oh my god, what the fuck? But they're no. no. Oh, he's into it, dude. Fuck yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm with this guy. He had to go I'm on his it. team. Jethro Tull, the chief shoutcaster. What a great name. Wait, is it a MOBA? It looks like it's a mix of like a battle royale with superpowers. Dude, Smite MOBA? I'm okay with it. Although I will say... Smite is a MOBA. No, I'm sorry. Smite uh, battle royale is what I mean. It looks kind of neat. And like a little generic. That's one twice. Whatever they're paying this guy's time. Dude, I love this guy. He goes invisible and takes out his ass. Dude, they ask you to go up on stage at E3 and shoutcast live. You either go all in or you go home. Like that's what I mean. Like the people in the Star Wars thing yesterday, where they're like, "Yeah, it looks pretty good." 
Like, I like this guy who's this like dude's selling the fucking game right oh, now. I don't get it. That didn't look interesting at all. Yeah, that, that, to be honest with you, that looks If you're into that style of game, I can see. Oh, Minecraft. Oh. Uh, yeah. I mean, it's, it's Minecraft. Yeah. You know, when you do more Xbox Minecraft now, Ryan, it's time to cover it again. <laughs> oh, and, and my, Minecraft Crossy Road. Hey, is that an alpaca? They, they've been adding skin packs basically for like a two, three dollars. Let it yeah. die. Let it They're die in response thing. to Minecraft. Yeah, that, that's someone with their finger on the pulse of the gaming nation. Yeah, no. <laughs> Minecraft is dead. <laughs> I'm not really sure you need to sell this anymore. I know, right? Yeah. Well, they do because they spent two billion dollars on it. Yeah. Why did they show an, a, a uh, Nintendo Switch at the Xbox? Because they just say unifying Minecraft, I assume it's going to be platform. Please welcome. Yeah, Microsoft. From Mo Yang, brand they, they director they Lydia Winter. Yeah, need, like, Microsoft owns Minecraft. Minecraft. It needs to, they need to sell it on every system. Wait, is it called Mo Yang? Yeah. Really? I was called Mojang. I was called Mojang, yeah. Is it Mo Yang? I had no idea. For the first time. Xbox Live will unite the global Minecraft community across mobile, VR, now, As far as I remember, you do have to pay, though, to play consoles. online in these versions. Really? You buy, like, a gate as part or of something? Effort, I don't really understand it, actually. I tried to look at it for a while. Skins, maps, textures, and massive community-run servers into maps? the game itself. Because we know yeah, that the make amazing maps. content you create oh, okay. makes Minecraft even better. This fall, Minecraft will receive this. a free 4K update There was like a pause break, that brings but no applause. Mm, just yeah. keep going. <laughs> keep going. <laughs> but we didn't I love these t-shirts. I witnessed the With most powerful console graphics, ever. Yeah. We're Where did you see that? One step That's further. all the people in the front. They're all wearing that shirt. Today, oh god! Well, like when you wait, wait till they get the cut to another audience. That we're yeah. super well, those, duper again, excited like, for you to try. It's three ninety nine per one month for three users, including the owner. And available this <laughs> or seven ninety nine for a server out. supporting up to eleven. Let's check it out. A new look for Minecraft. Yo, but what if they like? Deblocked all of Minecraft. It was like a new look, <laughs> and they just rounded all the edges. It's the pitch of like literally every single yeah. early access yeah. survival <laughs> game. <I've seen. laughs> it's a bunch of mods, though. Yeah, they, they added HDR lighting or something. No, like I have this mod man. on my computer right now. It looks like that. <laughs> it's pretty. Yeah. I mean, yeah. Good looking lighting. Yeah. I mean, Minecraft's fun. What is this that they're showing? It's just, it looks better now? <laughs> is that, new, is that gonna lighting. run though? That Super run duper, duper graphics pack. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Minecraft in 4K. When the Minecraft team showed me the first version of the game in 4K, I was blown away. I'm sure Mojang you know, is a great example of a studio that started something new and different that led to a global phenomena. At Xbox, one of the three great examples of that ever fresh, happening new, <laughs> in the <laughs> video game <laughs> industry. <laughs> that a third one only recently the happening with third party yeah. franchises <laughs> you want to play are there for you on Xbox One. Of course, you'll find these great games in the Xbox Store available for pre order today. <laughs> Please yeah. don't clap for that. Bringing the biggest blockbuster franchise is just one part of the job. Delivering broad, diverse, it's and just new so tone deaf to, to have an applause break for it. You can pre order these right now. Right, yeah. world, it's literally just giving money delight. for nothing and to then me, please these applaud. Next few games <laughs> do just that. Starting. With the game I We've got been to so play kind as to afford you the opportunity but, um, to buy this. It's hilarious, <laughs> a little crazy, and a whole lot of fun. Let's take a look at it. Oh, please don't tell me something's hilarious. World <laughs> you will laugh. <laughs> I don't think that shader pack will run in 4K. Not oh, at this. Oh, yeah. oh this looks fucking awesome. 
yeah, this is yeah, the yeah, new, yeah. Uh, yeah, the new fighting Arc System fighting. Works are the Guilty Gear and Blaze Blue people are making a Dragon Ball Z fighting game. Oh, 2. shit. 2.5D, and it's going to be awesome. I, I mean, gonna... I'm in. Let's see if it's good. You guys are too easy. Well, <laughs> no, I am I'm easy to sell on Arc System Works games. That's what it is. Okay, that I looks mean, really, really good like already. Like, like it can actually have damage. real combos and not aimlessly bullshit flying. <laughs> yeah, I'm in for this. That art style is fantastic. That looks, yeah, that looks really good. Rob, actually. 24 hours uh -oh. of us uh -oh. fighting each other. I mean, I'm down. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I'm going to be so bad at this. I can't wait to play through the Dragon Ball Z storyline to unlock like, this is the for yeah. the thousand time. <laughs> <laughs> this is the bridge that brings you into Arc System Works games. Live this all your really favorite pretty. Dragon Ball Z moments from 1986. Again! <laughs> <laughs> At least, like, in the later games, they start introducing, like, what if, like, a storyline. Yeah, yeah. So what if up. you played the Frieza saga? Again! <laughs> I mean, wow. that looks really pretty. This looks like garbage. This looks fucking amazing right yeah. next to each other. <laughs> Off the <laughs> The duality. They can't be saying this trash looks good. Exclusive. <laughs> but it does look good, and you're wrong. Just, just, just let that people looks like things. <laughs> Pearl Abyss, what is this? So a console launch exclusive, does that mean it will not be exclusive six months later? I think it just means that it's, like, on Xbox One first. <laughs> for an arbitrary uh, length of time. Yeah, it's almost... Conan right, Exiles, yeah. coming to Xbox. <laughs> <laughs> Man, that game was real popular for a week. I played it with Rob. It was trash. Yeah, it was yeah. pretty fucking bad. I played it for it's, like an hour. It's like really, really bad. Oh, but I made a character in Black Desert Online the other night. That's actually pretty cool. That game is... E3, you jokers. Why are we talking about Black Desert Online? I, because MMOs. I haven't played a lot of MMOs. This, I think, is Black Desert Online. I think, yeah, I think this is Black Desert Online. Jeez. <laughs> huh. I've, Turns I've out. Never, yeah, I've never eaten my own foot back. <laughs> <laughs> because this it's on the screen, yeah. Black Desert Online. <laughs> uh, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> <laughs> clip that, clip that. <laughs> The combat in BDO was really good, but... Oh, do we have to call it BDO, though? <laughs> is, this, uh, is this from the... What is that game? Uh, Vindictus. Is this from those developers? Like, I don't know. Is it from the Terra developers? No. No, Terra is working okay. on... Or the Terra people are working on something else, aren't they? Yes, I think Terra's next on Chetson. This is actually like something called side. Sure. So this this is like a little bit misleading if this is Black Desert Online, by the way, because not not misleading necessarily, but like a lot of the draw to that game is it's kind of got like an Eve Online like shop economy thing going on. Yeah, it's very open and sandbox. Yeah. Black Desert. So it's called the MMORPG Black Desert. Mm. You stupid idiots! It wasn't Black Desert Online. <laughs> <laughs> it's the regular Maybe version of Black condense, Desert. <laughs> Maybe they're condensing most of the servers into like four or something, saying it's truly yeah. online now or something. Terra is blue hole, really? Oh. Did I see, like, is this Lego Second World War? Hot Hot <laughs> That'd be is fucking that Abe, awesome. Is that too, like, is that, uh, what is it, like Abe's Odyssey? Is that Odd Tales? No. They never called it that, but maybe? They have Minecraft made, 2. They're making a game called The Last Night, which might be this. Published by Raw Fury. Whoa. Mm, oh, crazy. I like them. I like their typography. Is this an adventure game? Well, oh, that's a weird art style. It's interesting. Yeah, I like it, though. Yeah. The lighting is really good with the. Oh, look pixel at that guy. Art. That's cool. Yeah, it's cool, like 2.5D parallax thing. Yeah, going on. yeah, yeah. I think that's just for the trailer. I it hope not. That's a really cool style for the trailer. The last though. night. Wait, what is that? that I don't think I'll play it, but I like the art style. We're a little behind, Chad. I'll refresh after this trailer. Always oh, getting in a taxi cab. This Please is cool. David's about to walk out. That would be sick. <laughs> yeah, very Blade Runner ish. Yeah, hold on, let me refresh this. Yeah, I was thinking that too. Yeah. One sec, one sec, one sec. And one a perna. Same. Oh. 
a little dinosaur on the screen there. You see that? That's how to do it. Did, did Wes Anderson make a game? Is this night on night in the woods, but everyone's people now? <laughs> <laughs> the secret game of Walter Mitty. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, apparently Bob pause mode pause. Journey like. sand or snow. Oh, is this Wander Song? Or is it something that's Biden Wander Song? That's what taking acid is like? No. <laughs> Acid's got to be way cooler than this. Yeah. Is that Neil Sosiego? <laughs> <laughs> Brody Quest the game. Jacksepticeye. But could it actually be? <laughs> If Neil Cicierga made a game, that would be incredible. <laughs> <laughs> the artful escape. Coming when it's damn ready. That's a nice way nice. to put it. <laughs> yeah. well, let me try to refresh this one. Project V. <laughs> Alright. We were going to do Project Blood Gore, but it was taken. Got a lot of contrast. Whoa, that's a lot of leather. That did not make sense leather. to turn into that. Prototype, Prototype. Prototype. Yeah, right? <laughs> no, it's like near to human automatica. <laughs> this is Dark Souls. Yeah. I mean, to be honest, I'm down for more Souls combat. Yeah, me too. You gotta be. Man, this is so jacked. It's incredible. <laughs> <laughs> It's like Bayonetta meets Prototype meets Dark Souls. Code Bang. Ooh, shit. They're showing yeah, games. Looks, yeah, no, actually. Yeah, well, I'm calling it right now. That's getting delayed to 2019. Creative artists and development teams. <laughs> and I'm often surprised and humbled by their work. I think we may still be Whether a it's little story behind, but I'm not going to worry about it. Whether land or artistic design and storytelling that in a single moment can capture your imagination and inspire. There is much to be learned by looking beyond borders. Our first party is also a place of innovation and creativity. Today, <laughs> I'm excited to share with you an extended look at never-before-seen gameplay from Rare's <laughs> shared world adventure, Sea of Thieves. Oh, yeah, I forgot this game's coming out. Yeah, Exclusive. I hope this is good. It seems cool. Are we getting a Halo reveal today? I'm expecting it at the end. Ah, the joy of a new voyage far across Were the sea. All of for the whore. Are these like YouTubers? Hail you, shot Hannah, definitely a YouTuber. Not just you. She's here. Didn't, we saw this last year, oh, didn't we? Yeah, yeah. So this this not very much. Something else right of the same kind of thing. Exploring and reading with your fine pirate crew. Look at them, scurrying around, making themselves is that, useful. That's is that Simon Pegg? Like the I world of Sea of Thieves seethes with possibilities, with adventures I don't believe so, but below the waves. Bear chat says they All announced there's no Halo reveal. There she goes. Oh shit! Ah. All right. The sooner you know that, the better. Yeah, thanks for breaking it easy to me. <laughs> things tempt a pirate like the siren song of a lootable shipwreck. Careful. Was it this exact video? Down there. No. We already they're, watched they're, that they're before. No, they're messing we with you. I'm actually kind of excited joking. about this. That was a joke. Me too. Ah, sunken treasure. Yes. It's like a pirate. I mean, I'm not. I'm just bringing this to the attention because it's surprising to me. That dude held his breath for like 90 seconds <laughs> while swimming underwater. That's what you got to do in this era, man. Every That's incredible. Have you seen Alien Resurrection? But they swam underwater for like 10 minutes. Fortune, it pays to be this prepared. Just amazing. Being chased for by an alien. Of iron, these are surprisingly portable. Amazing workmanship. <laughs> anyway, better get them back on board while the coast is clear. There's really no sense in pushing your luck down here. Boobly. Oh, it's a shirt! It's not a beast you want to pick a fight with. Yes, it's possible to take on. Who is Bosun Bill? I'm gonna, I'm gonna You're not much used to your crew. I'm pretty sure these are just names created for the. Yeah. For the show. How's he gonna get up that ladder? Yeah. What's the system oh, here? Oyster, right? Sometimes a tactical is You're just gonna push it up? Oh. No, we're just gonna, all right. Yeah, just, all right. Just accept it. 
I'd probably just hoist it. Hail shot. Hannah's gonna get eaten. Oh, oh so close. The, the tension. There's a moment of celebration. <laughs> it was out of control. But for now, stow your hard-earned loot and enjoy the voyage. So I don't understand. Maybe because I didn't look it up too much. But Sea of Thieves is this supposed to be like MMOE? Like, what is the point? I think so. Sea of Thieves. Of thieves. No. Well, that's typical. Oh well, look, here we are at I don't Devil's Ridge. Truly, no. Nice transition, by the way. And so you'll shift from the heart of the sea to the island shore, where you'll explore jungles and coves, cliff tops and caverns. Cliff tops. Every region has its very own landmarks, and over time. Can we play you this in RP? Shortcuts. Abandoned yes. stashes, and Please. Like, take it really seriously. Oh, absolutely. I <laughs> and yes, sometimes you'll encounter people who. We'd all have to get Windows 10. Would like to blow uh, okay, Never mind. Yeah. That's pirate. One step out of you. <laughs> Keep that pistol primed, because you'll also face the roaming remains of those raiders who came before you. Caught no man, see their own legends. <laughs> oh, that looks like it's zero damage. Yeah. Skeleton has a gun. Yeah. I know. yeah. It's a gunnerton. That's not uh, periodic periodically accurate. Like That's too quick of a reload for that pistol. All your bets fall off. This one he he took me an okay, boost. Now, make sure you're he just ate that banana with the skin yeah, on. All he ate the stem. <laughs> Yeah, you know, I'm beginning to think they're not 100% concerned with realism in this game. <laughs> Can you read this note my mom gave me? <laughs> right, well, that's got to be around here somewhere. But if you've got a bad feeling, you can always leave someone on board to brace the ship for a speedy getaway. Decisions, decisions. Ah, looks like they've sniffed out that place where there is no sky. So to cave build your resources as you it was right behind you, though. Yeah, they found it, guys. <laughs> they turned around. It'd be easy to come a cropper in these claustrophobic caves. You don't want to wander off track. Unless, of course, you're streaming. And you'll have loads of people in the chat. Hey, guys, Twitch reference. Hey, yeah. Yeah. Hey, 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 You mean a mixer reference? Oh, yeah, yeah, that's true. Chat, give me a bud star to let me, let me know you're there, huh? Just Twitch chat. Hey, that's you. Yeah. Of course, the premier plunder isn't just lying around to be claimed by any old drunken bumbler. You'll need to watch yeah, it for all the torches on the walls, following your map, clues, and your instincts to make light work of each new mystery. Spooky? Oh, it's a demon. Light work. Well, lantern joke there. You're welcome. Anyway, step eleven paces northwest oh, through the, the glen. Lantern joke. Fuck. Dig my chest from its tomb. Was it good? And with that, we're one yeah. step closer to payday. Then again, some of the loot in these parts has lain undisturbed for a long, long time. That oh, has to be the spot. You can practically eat. taste the oh, treasure. Oh, hell yeah. Treasure. Oh, wow, that popped up fast. It is kind of cool. Good call on your double duty you, shovel like, work, too. That storm outside was not as hills. a waypoint on your map, but instead as verbal instructions. Or yeah, I'm definitely. Yeah. I, also like that, yeah. I just don't understand the point of the game. Ah, I guess I don't. Very is it nice. on, like only online? Can you can you be on a ship by yourself? Do you need of course other the trouble with treasure as I don't know is that the owners really like to hang on to. It. That's what skeleton. What I hope is that it's not literally this loop times as many times as you want to do it. Right. Yeah. yeah. We got the treasure. Now the wave's gonna spawn. Another strategic yeah. withdrawal with the loot. It'd be cool if you could make like a pirate, you know, base nope. and stuff. Oh, uh, when you said that, ships. it dawned on me that that is all this is gonna be. It probably <laughs> is. <yeah. laughs> There's 300 caves, a uh, series of islands, and you get the treasure, and that's. But there's also ship combat. But yeah, you can, and you can build your ship up probably with the treasure. Yeah, exactly. You're like, we're all in back uh, level two nice. cannons here. <laughs> all right, my enthusiasm is waned. <laughs> I mean, the combat of on land doesn't seem that interesting. Yeah, it's like, ah, without the music, this is just, oh, hey, they show up, and then you go, pop, and they're dead. Yeah. <laughs> but combat later, there's skeletons that have 75% more HP. Oh. Why Some of the skeletons them? wear helmets, so you can't shoot them again. Shit. Oh, he puts it on his back, you see? Oh, okay. Why didn't he just put it on his back the whole time? If you can regularly beat the odds and get chess back to your ship, You'll be able to turn a tidy profit by trading them in at an outpost. Okay, this is cool. That's just the tiny matter of making it through this storm in one piece. Okay, okay. You may be getting me back. 
So there is like a Sid Meier's Pirates. Oh, there, this is, is neat. What but what do you do with the money you get from trading? You get yeah, a better ship. boat, <laughs> more yeah. guns. And then you go back and do it again. Which is you like, we, we say that cynically, but it, in this game it might work okay. Yeah, it's a video game at the end of the day. Probably get upgraded eye patches and like freight drops. No, that's into the cannon? Alright, that's kind of. Oh, goodness. No, you can't do that. I'm <laughs> using the Donkey Kong did. Country Code from 1995. <laughs> that was amazing. An amazing shot. I feel like this is I a mean, terrible idea. Couldn't the other, like, three just pull their gun and shoot him? <laughs> he kind of just did this by himself. Right, yeah. He's sort of just launching himself into his own guaranteed death, unless Higher the other ropes, people are terrible. Shooting ropes. Like, ropes. <laughs> like, shooting ropes. <laughs> that guy was terrible at shooting. Yeah, they're all terrible. Who did my first mate? Some mutiny max. And now we have two boats. You know what it would bring me back a little bit is if you could steal their boat and then sell it in for it. Please tell me. Oh, they're ditching him. You probably can. Try not to be that one. Yeah, there it is. There's the, the yeah. shark payoff. Wow, that's rude. I'm going out on a limb for them. That seems cool. I'm still into it. Exclusive. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not against it. It's kind of. It looks cool. Yeah. yeah. Got me back at the end. Oh, hey, Fulbright. Hmm. Fulbright, what do I know them from? That would be... Oh, it's... Is that Gone Home? No. Uh, is Fulbright Gone Home? Not gone yet. Home developers yes. are making Vampire, aren't they? No. This is... Fulbright uh, is Gone I'm Home. I'm not sure if this is this. Fulbright is Gone Home. They're making Tacoma right now. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'll play it. I really like Gone Home, so... I don't know what that game is, though. They've not explained it at all. That's a city yeah. near me. Exclusive. Correct, yeah. Exclusive. Tech? Oh, Vampire is Focus. Yeah, yeah, you're right, you're right. I thought Vampire was published by Focus, but it's I made think it's by... Folk, yeah, it's, uh, it's made by the Life is Strange developers, I thought. Yeah, Life is Strange, guys, yeah. Focus on Gone Home Interactive. <laughs> Conquer? Uh, no, is that, is this... It's the VR I, Fox. The VR. Yeah, I was gonna say, isn't this the VR, like, platforming? Lucky's Tale, I think? So yeah, they're, they're yeah. porting it to the Xbox VR is the thing? Is that what's happening? I thought Xbox wasn't getting VR. That's what uh, I thought, too. Yeah. Is it rabbits? Yo, that thing's got the rabbit's eyes, man. No, <laughs> it's not rabbits. Yo, it had the rabbit's eyes. <laughs> I don't think it did. Plants versus Lucky's Tale? Okay, let's go. <laughs> yeah, this is Lucky's Tale. Yep, yep, yep. That's a weird not. decision. So they're Are just they... making it not VR, I guess. You could not That's... maybe play this. <laughs> I have this, and I only played it for five minutes. Isn't, like, the main draw of this that it's, like, VR? It made me feel sick. Well, Chad, I'd like to take this opportunity to thank you all uh, for tuning in to our Roundtable E3 coverage, by the way. In all sincerity, thanks for hanging out. We're still going to continue to cover, of course, but we've also yeah, got a couple more conferences tomorrow and Tuesday as well. If you like what you're seeing here, and you got a Twitch Prime subscription, maybe you want to drop that on the channel. That supports you get us exclusive as well. 4K audio. That's right. That's also not true. <laughs> or there's always the Patreon. That's also not there's true. also the Patreon. Yeah, Patreon.com/Roundtable. If you want to just Send a few bucks a month our way. Support us Pay doing us the show. We really appreciate shit that. on other people's hard work. <laughs> <laughs> Please and thank you. I'm not just saying this to be incredibly rude, but if you had to place the smart money on what will be the worst game shown off during this conference, <laughs> I think there's a decent chance. I could be wrong. It, it Maybe this will be great, but it looks like... Getting I mean, like it a looks bad like a team, mighty like number that. nine vibe from it or something. <laughs> it looks fine, but it like... looks like an old school platformer, but yeah. minus the charm. It looks it's generic like, as hell. Like yeah, the really yeah. the lower budget. Super lucky oh, style. Oh, it's super. Oh, shit! Coming to a subscriber Sunday stream in November 2017. <laughs> We need a neck killer. That's why we're losing. <laughs> <laughs> hey.
Hey, it's Cuphead. Oh, it's Cuphead. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, a special announcement for a thrilling game. Our fifth E three presentation. The Cuphead way is canceled. Before. Oh my! <laughs> it's Cuphead. The incredible Cuphead coming to theaters now. <laughs> See him ride around on cars and fight evil Medusa in the ocean. <laughs> Introducing Satan. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, September 29th. All right, we got a date. Oh, God damn it! It's going to be a fucking Windows 10 exclusive. That sucks. Ugh. Exclusive. Yeah, exclusive. To be good. fair, they need as many exclusives as they can fucking get. Yeah, but they're just throwing that in front of, like, Super Lucky's tail. That doesn't <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Crackdown 3! Oh, uh, yes. there it is. Alright. With Terry Crews. Terry Crews! Really? They were showing this before they the thing the started, though. It's, like, exactly the right tone you need for right. Crackdown. We're gonna yeah. Light it back up, because this is far from over. In fact, it's only just begun. That's why we brought in you. you Did you know Terry Crews is 71 years old? Oh my no, god. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> what if I had what if I had said 55? I, I believe you. like 40. Oh no, he's like I think he might be in his 50s. No way. I believe that. I'll look it up. Cruz, he's 40 48? Oh my god. <laughs> Step. Oh, yeah, 55 wouldn't have been that far off at all. I thought he was younger. Pyrotechnics, guys. <laughs> oh, yeah. Welcome to the Asian Sea. Yeah. Welcome to the Asian Sea? Yeah, is that what he said? <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to the Asian Sea. Welcome to the Asian Sea. I'm, I, I, I'm, I'm a sucker for Crackdown. I'm into it. Uh, first one yeah. was really fun. The first Crackdown was yeah, really, Crackdown really good. Except Crackdown 2. I didn't like Crackdown 2, though. I'm a fan of the <laughs> whole series. The second one wasn't so strong, bro. No, I thought the Crackdown 2 was still fun. Welcome to the Asian Sea, chat. <laughs> So I guess they kind of ditched that whole completely destructible buildings idea, huh? Because that was like the focus of their whole presentation of it last time. Oh, oh you still remember that, huh? We were uh, <laughs> banking on uh, the Terry Crews thing kind of being a diversion. <laughs> All right, well that's fine, I guess. I was looking forward to the destructible buildings, though. That's a cool trailer effect. Yeah. Sorry to stow the cynicism for a brief moment there as I <laughs> just appreciated something cinematically impressive. Oh, there's a mech I'm in! Oh, you don't get to play as the mech. Never mind. Mike gets to play as the mech. That'd be cool. There's all kinds of cars and shit, so it could be a mech. I'm down for Crackdown. Yeah! yeah. yeah. Is it a Windows 10 exclusive? Yeah, of course. Probably. Everything is coming out on the 7th, which I guess makes sense because that's when the console's releasing. Ooglets! Uh, oh, Did you guys see Ooglets? No. Ooh, what was that? Oh. That's so sad. Oh, we did a no, series on that. that. Yeah. <laughs> I wonder how, is it any, was it any good at the time? Because I never played no. it. No. Yeah. Oh, it was Unruly Heroes. That's what I was thinking of. That was cool. Yeah, Path of Exiles is really good. Yeah. Battle Ride's good. Yeah. I'm so excited for Surviving Mars. Yeah, Look Bamboo out. Chopsticks, we're doing the Major 3, that's correct. I'm doing all of them. Sir. Yeah. Oh, interesting. Dunk Lords, hey! It's all that yeah! Event. I'm excited for this, man. Is that like NBA Playgrounds? It's more like NBA. It's one. Of, it's the uh, programmer of Spelunky who's making it. Ooblets. Oh really? I didn't know that. Yeah, Don't Lords. You guys should care about Ooblets. It's like Pokemon. Oh, what's that about Pokemon? That looks cool. Dark and light. Who's that? Dark and light. I bookmarked that. Hey, New World, everybody. <laughs> that game. <laughs> Hello, neighbor. I played like a 0. 0.0002 alpha of that. Me too. Oh, oh god. 
<laughs> Whoa, that happens in that game? Yeah. Yeah, so there are monsters and shit now. That's not really in the game. <laughs> Come on. At Xbox, it's not just about finding creative artists. It's about empowering My father, them and nurturing Tywin them. Lannister, <laughs> led the army <laughs> on their landing, making it easy for them to build and share their creations. The text That's from the subtitles the was going Xbox like leading into so his title, and it was freaking me out a little mm. bit. The team has released over 500 games on Xbox One Ooh. and Windows 10 through the ID at Xbox program. And this is not just a milestone for the program and the independent developer community. It's a milestone for everyone. Stone. 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 <laughs> Got him. I hope you're reminded Fucking today idiot. why it's so great to they be cheer the for exclusives. Action, yeah. adventure, story, skill, Are we seeing Anthem surprise. first? These next oh, probably. few games bring it we all need the together. price of the score or the X. Let's start yeah. with a game whose stylistic approach alone the price. makes it something. Did they say stylistic very approach alo alone guaranteed below. Exclusive enough. <laughs> 100%. Why don't you below me? No, this is oh, nice. Soma. Or no. What? Soma? I've never the heard of Aurora 44. Than the light. Me either. Oh, please, another survival game. I don't have enough. Oh, is, is it below? Because you see a lantern, doesn't it? Yeah, that's <laughs> a quick job, man. <laughs> uh, a campfire. And you're the one who plays all the survival games! I'm aware! <laughs> okay, this is starting to look more like it. But that light was a betrayal. Oh! Only fleeting. Ugh, that is a persona up. persona. Okay. Ew. Well, they In have no wake, face. The night returned to claim us. They have to go get their faces from the demons underground. Oh, Okay, so Dark Souls After combat. Times, the light grows again. again, I don't say that cynically. This also reminds me a bit of Necropolis. Yeah, it does, huh? Yeah. Especially the lack Which of faces. Which is now a bad thing, I guess. Yeah. Don't yeah. don't damn it with faint praise. <laughs> the low polyness. That looks like below, doesn't it? But this is clearly not below. Yeah, that door really looked like below. Yeah. Is below still like in development? Is is that... No. Yeah, that one, right? Of course. Honestly, it didn't come out and I didn't realize it, right? No, no. it hasn't come out. Okay. Look, it's, uh, what's his face? You gotta use the Stormbreaker. Oh, the giant Gorm? Yeah, yeah Yorm. Yorm the giant. Gorm. It's, oh my god, I thought it said ascend for a minute. I'm like, it's not below, Ash. it's ascend. Ashwin. <laughs> As win. That looks, that looks pretty decent. <laughs> that looks cool, yeah. World premiere. It implied like co op, which is cool. Ooh, Square Enix. Yeah. I've heard of them. Oh, this is a Life is Strange 2. Mm. I haven't even finished the first one. <laughs> Get on Calm it. Calm down. Don't Wait. smoke cigarettes. It's bad for you. <laughs> <laughs> This is a bad message, chat. Don't listen to it. I like the vibe of this game. Oh, especially don't smoke cigarettes in Oregon. <laughs> well, they're gonna show we're getting shot. Don't live in Oregon. Don't live in Oregon. The premise is she can go back in time and change her mind about smoking. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. I feel numb in this kingdom. Oh, Game of Thrones crossover? Is she doing an indie band now? <laughs> oh no! <laughs> that arm go through that mirror? Rachel? <laughs> Rachel! <laughs> Where's Rachel? Where's Rachel? Having still not played this, I get the impression that this has very much the same vibe as Night in the Woods. Eh. It's more like a Diablo Cody video game. <laughs> Kinda. Robert, nobody else knows the names of screenwriters. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what that means. <laughs> you know, make your jokes more inclusive. I mean, you guys have seen Michael Juno, Deplier. right? It's like yeah. that. I don't know the screenwriter's name though. I like oh, you. Oh, now we're talking. 
This actually, I've seen some stuff about this. This looks cool. Lawn the on a shade. You burned my mind. I'll kill you. Until this moment, you have not known suffering. There's a Russian troll. I can't take trolls seriously anymore. Why not? They're always saying something and then doing the opposite. Can't take him at the word. <laughs> oh, I did nothing, your mouth bruise. Can you play so as the trolls now? I think now. you can recruit them to be like part oh, of your sweet troll you army. Yeah. Uh, yeah. And then send them to fight other people, maybe. Get the one with the biggest man tits. Well, there's like, um, so like there's a whole, with the, with the captain system and stuff, like you, you actually are trying to take over like a castle and an area. And then you, you recruit an army to take down the castle and shit. I'm... Decided I'd like to have Bruce the Chopper on my team. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I like yeah, he him. just said he liked him, so. I like him. <laughs> yeah. it's, it's Assassin's Creed! We introduced yeah. a way they did that exact same thing. <laughs> but it looks better here. That actually reminds me mostly of Horizon Zero Dawn now. Two new features we're really excited about Reminded me of Tomb Raider. And Nemesis Whoa, that was kind of neat. Here, we'll use the Ring of Power and recruit this Olog, Bruce the Chopper. Is that a Zelda now? I guess it's a Zelda, army. too. Then, <laughs> we're going to assault a fortress. I don't think there's a game at this point that does not have a slow mo bow and arrow dropping from a yep. yeah. large sequence. You can't play as Frodo in this, right? <laughs> no. Frodo would get his bitch ass. Yeah, but that's kind of why I want to play as him. <laughs> you want to get your bitch ass beat? As Frodo, yeah. Uh, that little sword's good for a tickle, maybe. But you're gonna need he looks like Michael Bay's Ninja Turtles. <laughs> it does! <laughs> Your hands look like stupid watermelons. Dude, here's, here's my line of thinking. Yeah. I'm a 12 foot tall. 500 pound ogre beast. Yeah. yeah. The last dude I just fought, I killed him by knocking him down and then grabbing his head and tearing it off. The yeah. second I've got a smaller creature in my hand, that's when I tear his head off. Yeah. Don't give him the option to get this shit going. <laughs> Same thing, really. In results, me ripping spines out, which I like to do anyway. That's so very jolly. Win. What is? Nice. <laughs> got a lot of charisma. My name's Bruce. <laughs> From here on out, I will be your shadow. No one gets to you without my say-so. Don't worry about my enemies. They will all follow eventually. Dude, this is Bruce the shark from Finding Nemo. <laughs> His name is Bruce. It's the same guy. Oh, it, it's probably a. Uh, it's probably a nod then. Deadly smart. I was thinking it too. The dude looks like Jamie Lannister. You take him down, you'll send a message to Sauron and get yourself some nice new digs as part of the bargain. I'm not going to do this alone. Gather your troops. We'll do. Ooh. Just make sure you let me pop his heads off, won't you? <laughs> <laughs> Got me to laugh. I'm I don't like this character, man. man. Or are they just making a joke so for the trailer? Have a few loyal that's, that's pretty much the tone of, recruiting Bruce at least of uh, Shadow of Mordor. It's like... And overthrow the Overlord. Yeah. I it's... thought it was super serious. I don't remember. Oh anything no! Like that. I mean, no, like really. the final boss and like the main story is kind of serious, but the rest of it is a little silly. Mordor's a massive I mean, you deal with Ratbag for like the first half of it. He's just, yeah. he's just an unfortunate <laughs> name. Wildlife, as well as stories and secrets. <laughs> you cleave me in two. Any other Push crimp died, but I survived. He's got a metal Push jaw. Yeah. Well, he did so get cleaved in two, apparently. In <laughs> level twenty-five, that's pretty high. They didn't make me into what I am. You did. You created the machine. No! The thing that they need to do to make it more interesting is actually 
It, it has like the uh, the hand of fate problem where the combat is actually so fluid that it was a little too easy. So yeah, it was a very yeah. common story that you just never get killed by any of the dudes who come back. Yeah. So you never yeah. get to appreciate the nemesis system. So I went in a think... castle and I just fought them forever and they could never beat me. I think I had like a 200 hit combo. Yeah. What is? It's Batman combat. So if you mastered it, then. What's yeah, stopping us from just dominating the all the time? So we can take advantage of his Nothing. abilities during the fortress. Sometimes you might want to chop their head off, I guess. So just, yes, to, yeah. just to do it. Before we charge head first into battle, we should plan our attack and select our followers. But yeah, that part's not going to change. My main gripe with Shadow of Mordor was that, like, the story mode had basically nothing to do with the Nemesis system. Yeah. Like, it was, they were just kind of separate entities, and the story mode was kind of boring. But, like, the final uh, boss is actually one of the worst final bosses in yeah. one of the best games I've ever played. Well, <laughs> one of the best games of the last generation or this generation, sorry. But this one, they've said, I've watched trailers of this, they said that the Nemesis system influences the story this time. Mm. So it's actually, like, tied in. At least they weren't all just orcs and, like, big trolls. Is there anything yeah. more interesting to kill? Oh, yeah, there's loads of things. There's other dudes sometimes. They have, like, dragons and wizards and tree people in Lord of the Rings. Why aren't those? Dragons are going to be in this game. I know that. It yeah, you already. can ride a dragon in this. You focus on right. the defenders. Define focus. Bold prediction. This guy has so many voice lines, you capture him in a story miss mission and <laughs> yeah. becomes your never number goes. one lieutenant forever. Yeah. 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 Wow, why is there Chad so mad? I just want dragons. To forge your story and conquer Mordor in Shadow of War. And we can't wait to show you more this week at E3. Thank okay. you very much. Whoa. Yeah, oh wow. my god. Holy oh, shit. <laughs> it's Littlefinger Jacket. <laughs> Leia Organa? That's what I was going to say. <laughs> <laughs> oh, all right, piano time. Ooh, nice. Uh, there are dragons, then why are you mad at me? I just wanted dragons. There are dragons. Raise your sad boys in chat for solo piano time. <laughs> this is when they announced the next Gears of War, right? That's what I was going to say. You know, <laughs> this is the mournful Gears of War song. <laughs> no. It's, it's uh, going to be a new oh, Ori, Ori in the Blind Forest 2? Yeah, there's a new one. Ori and I forget what they're calling it. Whoa, Ori really? Ori can Ori see Ori. forest. Ori Everyone in the forest is oh, happy. Oh, 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 please. It's really pretty. Please. Ooh. Oh my god, that looks incredible. The frog's eyebrows are mushrooms. <laughs> oh, it's totally Ori. Ori and the Take My Money. <laughs> <laughs> Ori and the Blinder Forest. Yo! <laughs> I'm totally hyped. I had no Ori idea this was a thing. Manor. I still never played oh. the first one. It's, I Rob, you have to, dude. It's, it's, it's yeah. fucking incredible. It's only slightly worse than Hollow Knight. <laughs> that's a huge compliment! Uh, it's, no, seriously. Like, that sounds a little worse than it should, because it's, it's <laughs> fucking incredible. Yeah, no, I know. I won't play it. I'll play it. F you neck? Come on! Look at the <laughs> owl! <laughs> oh, we Sad need owl. gameplay footage in advance before we get excited about no, it. No, dude, I'm I'm totally no. blind hype for Ori 2. Absolutely. I've played the original really one. You know what it looks like, you know how it plays. Yeah. For this one, they're just gonna make another Metroidvania, basically. You know? Oh man, if you played the first one, this is so much better! <laughs> wow, spoilers. <laughs> Have they sneak a piano on stage? Or they just drove <laughs> it up in a Porsche 911 GTR. Uh, Porsche didn't actually have an engine, they just pulled it out of there. <laughs> I had no idea Ori they were making that. my belief in the beauty, artistry, and heart within the art of gaming. Huh. We believe that games, the art in the art of gaming. like books, movies, and music, should be celebrated and enjoyed.
by countless generations. Wow, that's this is not all file no substance the game. And Don't give me that. The games <laughs> you own, the classics of the past, and the genres you love to play. That's why two years ago we launched the Xbox. How many times they got Shadow Complex program. and Super Meat Boy on there? No, I see a lot Xbox of Super Meat <laughs> Boy. We're Xbox talking about Ori. When did this happen? And we've seen tremendous growth <laughs> in the E3. program. Oh. Today, <laughs> Shareholders our don't library care about Ori, of games man. stands at 385 titles, and over half of Xbox One gamers have played a backward compatible game. Oh boy, thank you but for I've that heard your stat. feedback yeah, and We you really don't more. care about that one at all. <laughs> Today, <laughs> I'm pleased to announce an exciting expansion to the program. Everybody up front standing. Woo! <laughs> It just showed the Xbox logo. Why is it Yeah, what? What do we do? They're going to get original Xbox games now. <laughs> oh. That is not worth that ovation. <laughs> Look at them like, all pumping their fists. Like, it's like 10 of them were caring Our about it. What was on Xbox? The original Xbox, like Halo 1. Hard to bring us some of your Halo 2. Phantom Dust. Xbox <laughs> game to today's Xbox One library. A solid six Including games. a fan favorite that I'm asked about often by the community. Crimson Skies. Oh, well, Crimson Skies is a wonderful game. And it looks yeah, it great. is. You like that. I've never and played like that. the Xbox Crimson 360 Skies games, is a good game. OG it's games a great will look better game. and play better right. across Excuse the me, Xbox One family. multiplayer as well via Xbox Live. We'll have more Live. to share about this program when it launches later this year. Oh, yeah, Otogi. That was never backward compatible on the 360. I'm proud of the library of games available today on Xbox One. All of them will benefit from the performance and power <laughs> when you play them on Xbox One X. But we won't stop there. I'm excited to announce that if you own Gears of War 4, I do. Forza Horizon 3, no. Killer Instinct, yes. Halo Wars 2, yes. or Minecraft, yes. we'll pre be providing 4K updates to these titles for free. Nifty. Cool. I don't have a 4K TV, but thank you. <laughs> and we already have over 30 titles from our third-party partners that are planning to provide free updates as part of our Xbox One X Enhanced program. Uh, well, somebody said shut up Mathis in chat. I just want to take this opportunity to let you know we have a Patreon goal over on patreon.com slash roundtable. Head on over there, pledge a few bucks to a month, and maybe you'll get us closer to that $50,000 a month goal to make Mathis shut up permanently. And Rocket League, just to name a few. Permanently, though? That was the guy who owned like probably those three original have Xbox games. A large library of titles <laughs> that you own today that will like, automatically. Ghost Recon Wildlands 4K Xbox update. Rocket League 4K today, update. Yes. We showcase some of the world's greatest creators with a lineup of different types of games for every type of gamer. We showed you the largest and most diverse lineup of new no, games that have ever appeared on, on our strong stage. Here, I think. Otherwise, from every it's, corner of the it's globe, gonna be the thing. From they're the gonna show you yeah. mm. 42 games, just sort of including okay. 22 like, with console. This is a lot better than their last year presentation. Line. Yes, and the I year agree. before that, and the year before yeah, that. True. Uh, yeah. They actually like showed up this time. I'll yeah, they did. You're also going to be able to play. There was all at least a minimal amount of this guy trying to sell me on Xbox One, and every game will play great across the Xbox One family. And on Xbox One X, runs every single game you've seen. I feel like seen, that guy got a little confused. Better. He almost said Xbox One X. He did. You, you yeah. did it too. He was, yeah, he Xbox was. Xbox so One X. If you haven't X. joined the Xbox One family, <laughs> now's the letters. time. I wonder how confusing that this is in house. You'll find Xbox They've one only got one letter left. They kind of just like jumped to the end. Yeah. And on November 7th, we'll begin worldwide rollout of Xbox One X, the world's most powerful console at $499. Yep, there it is, 500 bucks. Yeah. Be the first nice. to experience unrivaled power and performance on the Xbox One. Chad, give me a quick vote yay or vote, yay, vote nay on your opinion on the $500 price tag for the Xbox One by X. looking to the future with a really great partner. They've been with us from the earliest days of Project Scorpio. The but earliest. And they're building the an but incredible earliest. game <laughs> that takes advantage of the power and the egg of the Xbox the egg One game. family. They didn't change the and controller at all, did they? One X. Please welcome no. Patrick Sutherland, That's nice. Executive Vice President, EA Truthfully World though, like, today? No, Patrick Ooh. Sutherland's got that strut. <laughs> you can get a PC for 600 bucks that 
is his new powerful. IP. This is a tall it's the human. It's lifeblood of our industry. Yeah. You can't Here comes tell Anthem, very which well. is also what risky. looks like BioWare's own at uh, EA, Destiny. We have teams dreaming up a lot of projects. Synergy and only the greatest will make Zenith it their way Pinnacle through. business. And that's okay. Synergy, it's yeah. all a part of the creative process. Marketing, BioWare, <laughs> because when Let's you find go. something special, <laughs> there's no better feeling <laughs> as a developer than introducing it's robot, players. It's You're right. Yeah. The world. And as a player, there's no better feeling than losing yourself in a completely new Look, in this world, you take out your business stick and you fuck the consumer, or do you make them suck you off, <laughs> or you <laughs> die on the side of the road, beaten and blooded by somebody else's business it's dick. Lush, savage, <laughs> it's called business dick. And ever changing. <laughs> Filled with interesting characters and new types of gameplay. You'll oh enjoy God, is he friends. gonna talk about Alex Hunter again? Who's that? This is what's possible when we take an extraordinary FIFA. vision and combine it with the latest technology yeah, of NHL. Not Amazing really. concepts become NHL. possible. <laughs> Bring me back. Great ideas become reality. NHL for PC this year. So Do here it. we are. Yo, if they so say that so the sports games are going to be on Windows 10, I'll switch. On behalf of the team at Actually, Bioware, that could let's probably see get me. what this game looks yeah, like. Yeah, if, if one of them is on NHL. Xbox One X. <laughs> Here's John Warner from Bioware to show you Anthem. Oh, it is Anthem. Yeah. I like the banjo. Hi, I'm John Warner, game director for Anthem. Here is the world premiere of Anthem's gameplay. Frostbite Angel. Gameplay? I asked what this was before, and I don't think anyone could explain it. It was like Destiny well, and something else. Wow. Because yeah, there was no, they didn't really show anything good. yesterday. Yeah, but like. I know, man. I know all the caveats. <laughs> I understand where we're at here. They're in but Star Wars fuck world, me, right? That looks good. Listen, there's trouble. Big That's trouble. great facial what animation too. Holy shit! <sighs> Mistake. I'm not gonna look like that. I hired some people. They weren't freelancers. I know. They, they said, said they the same it. thing about Battlefront. The price was right. I thought maybe it's Frostbite. Frostbite always looks good. That's right. true. It was stupid. I'm sorry, but they're still out there, somewhere. If you could just bring them back. Anything you need. Great lighting, too. In the world of Anthem, you, you and your friends are you freelancers. You and your friends are freelancers. The heroes who leave the safety of the walls of yes, Fort Tarsus to explore the unknown and protect humanity. Oh, hell yeah. Let's join two players as they head out on an expedition. Do you get to pick your mech? I hope so. You ready to go? Yeah, some pardon supplies. me, some unabashed Spread. optimism, what chat. Jesus. <laughs> that must smell <laughs> awful in that thing. I <laughs> predicted <laughs> the, the cycle. <laughs> if they can out Destiny, Destiny, then. Do it. But who do consumers hate more right now, Bioware or Activision? Well, good question. Yeah, who's Activision? Do people still hate Activision? They haven't. They, have, they don't make a lot of games. Every player will own an array of exosuits we call javelins. These suits give players superhuman capabilities. Yeah, I think you pee in this suit. And are heavily That's customizable, how it goes. so they look and yeah. play how you want. Oh, and they recycle it into the water that you can drink Man, in the suit. Mm -hmm. Looking good. It's cool. Oh, here comes the here comes the script nice. to talk. I got a mortar yeah, that was a hero landing. Yeah, I got it on the weekend. You lead the way. I'll follow. This looks pretty. Goddamn good, doesn't it? Yeah, that. I mean, no, that's I pretty. Go to the skybox to the right. Yeah, no kidding, dude. <laughs> Don't what go down there. Team. Nobody gives a shit about the stupid tunnel. Oh. This is a vast open world wow. you explore with your friends. I love flying Each in video games. Each has its own unique play style. The Ranger is balanced and a purpose. While the Colossus is a tanking power. Chat, that skybox may not have been playable Let's game go. area. It may have just been set oh, dressing. Shit. Is it lagging for y'all? Yeah. 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 For a second. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. The world of Anthem is hostile, and threats can come from any direction. This dynamic world where the unexpected is around every corner. It's another Rancor. Well, geez, take a shot at him before I know, right? he murders yeah. all local <laughs> fauna. Fuck. No, wait. No, we don't want to show combat yet. <laughs> What is gonna stop me from just flying away from here? Yeah, I'm wondering. I'll go low. You fly. Oh, and swimming. 
And apparently swimming. Oh, that's awesome! <laughs> this looks really cool, but I must for my no. expectations. No, dude, I'm just no, gonna. I'm going all in. Let's do it. Fuck it. I'm ready. <laughs> this is heavily scripted. Yeah. Oh yeah. Though. I'll play apparently devil's advocate and be really hyped about it. <laughs> Remember what Jeff's not, not gonna, gonna look, look like this, this though. What's there? It's possible. This isn't be that far off. No, no. This it'll look. I think this good. I'm just curious what the gameplay is gonna be. Are we gonna be looking at Destiny style, just like loot run missions, or right? It's 3D. Uh, if it's just uh, if it's another if it's another just fucking loot game, then I just I won't give a shit. I think I it's so flying, easy to say it's a massive open area, and then it's very convenient and easy to stay away from the edges of the world. I think we got some action. Yeah. It's been used so many times, like, skyboxes are very convincing now, you gotta look out for them. You can equip your Javelin exosuit with gear that brings Like, Horizon to combat. came out this year, and this does not look much better than that. But it's definitely a noticeable improvement over even that. Did they say this is for PC? Oh, there are a lot of yeah, Windows Bioware, I'm sure. Yeah. Oh, the scars have a heavy. Too many games for Windows 10 now. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> covering fire. There's a bunch more coming in. Ooh, console aim. That's a die. That's pretty badass. Yeah. <laughs> oh, come on. Horizon looks oh, comparable. Oh, yep, it's loot. Oh, yeah. God oh, damn it. Mm. Oh, nice. It's just gonna be Destiny style loot. Which I get, Pete, that's if Large people like that kind of thing. Me personally, like I'm not. Storms are yeah. dynamic and pull you off the beaten path with the promise of new stories to discover. Shaper Storm incoming. Okay. Oh, Shaper Storm. I hate those. Hold on a sec. Do the max fuck. <laughs> I need <laughs> to know. <laughs> that that really looks like this. Emojis. Honest to God, is coming off as Bioware's Destiny. They're gonna call it Destiny. Yeah. It really just feels. It just is coming off as Destiny. Ooh. If it's like. uh Borderlands kind of loot, then I wouldn't be terribly against it. This is Destiny, isn't it? I don't know. Uh, kinda. You get a lot less of it in Destiny than you do in Borderlands. Yeah. That's gonna fuck oh, your that... bitrate if you stream this, by the yeah, way. That yeah, it totally is. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Chad. Luckily, it is not gonna look like Our story that, is so. Yeah, <laughs> that's true. <laughs> Luckily. Uh. Yeah, that's gonna run in 4K on the Xbox One X for sure. <laughs> 60, 4K 60, 60, 60 FPS. Second, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, this is the part where they give us the montage of games. That yeah, feel. yeah. Feel true excitement. In true 4K. <laughs> Not that false 4K the others are advertising. <laughs> world premiere, world premiere, world premiere. <laughs> Xbox exclusive world premiere true 4K. Minecraft! <laughs> I don't know, I mean, I thought, like, the conference was workmanlike. There was nothing particularly, like, super revolutionary or exciting, but, yeah. you know, I can't deny that you're right, they did, they played trailers for games. I mean, what else do you, yeah. what else do you expect? Metro, I think I'm walking away with the most excitement for. Metro, yeah. And Crackdown well, 3, I think. I am beyond like hype. times better than last year. Yeah, yeah, it was better, better than last, last year's year. for sure. I agree yeah. with that definitely. Agreed, yeah. I'm beyond hype for Ori. I am, I'm on the fence about Sea of Thieves, but maybe I'd try it out. Yeah. Uh, I'll, I'll play. Uh, what is it called? Ambush or what was that last one called? Anthem. 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 Yeah. Anthem, yeah. I'll definitely yeah. some big overly grandiose concept now. That's what we call games like that. Yeah. I wanna. I wanna see more about that. That Space Wars thing. Actually, oh like yeah, the Aston Air looking thing. thing. Yeah, mm -hmm. none of it was shown. Kinda... Though screams, please spend five hundred dollars on our console for me. Right. Yeah, <laughs> I kind of think. Oh, it just that... ended. Yeah. Oh, all right. There it goes. Look like garbage. Though. So, 
Suddenly over. All right. Yeah, it's over. <laughs> All right. I'm just and it's over. Turn so Anthem was our Halo for this year. Sweet. Yeah. I mean, it could be, could be good. All right. I, in, in terms of premise, like, I mean, if you're going to get excited, at least it's not just like a, another, you know, Bioware game that is an RPG set in space. Yeah. Right. Yeah. yeah. True. True. Absolutely. You're not wrong. Well, hey everybody, thanks for hanging out for our Microsoft E3 coverage. If you, uh, if you're interested in seeing more, we'll be live again tomorrow, Monday, June 12th at six o'clock Pacific time for the Sony conference, and uh, then we'll be covering whatever in the world Nintendo is doing at uh, 9 a.m. on Tuesday as well. Uh, but thanks for being here. Appreciate you. If you uh, have no idea what this is, this is our. This is our uh, channel for our podcast, Roundtable Live, that we do every Friday at 3 o'clock Pacific, 6 p.m. Eastern. This is me, Northern Lion, Rockley Smile, Mathis Games. We're here for you. We'll catch, or, uh, you can catch the VOD of the podcast and of this, I think. I'm pretty damn sure I'm going to be able to upload this on YouTube uh, over yeah. on YouTube.com slash Bear Taffy and, of course, Mathis Games and Rockley Smile as well. Thanks, Alpaca Patrol, for joining us, too, who should be here for the Sony conference, right? Uh... Yep, I'll be here. I, I might not be able to uh, do it tomorrow, actually, because it's Jess's birthday tomorrow. Oh, okay. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Happy birthday, but, Jess. Um, <laughs> yeah. All right. Yeah. Well, in that case, we may not see Rob tomorrow, but we'll see you all tomorrow here for the Sony conference. Mm -hmm. So thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you then. Later. Yeah. Bye. Goodbye. Bye, guys. Um.